What's up guys, Sinclair Photos here, and it is day two in Austin, Texas. We just woke up this morning. You cannot really see the view, but it isn't much to look at from this hotel room anyway. So, today, we're gonna go try to go to Circuit of the Americas and watch all the cars. We're all gonna roll up together, so there shouldn't be any problems, but if there is, we'll figure them out. <laughs> I hope we can figure them out because that's the whole reason I came up here. But yeah, Circuit of the Americas today with all the cars we saw last time. Let go. Alright, so we got the McLaren P1 sitting out front of the hotel in race mode along with the wicked F12 Berlinetta and then we got an R8, a GT3 RS, and then a Z06 on the other side. Well, let's check out this P1 for a second. Oh my god, the carbon fiber on that roof scoop with the orange accents just looks too good to be true. I cannot wait to see this guy rip it around the track. This is gonna for sure be a really special race day, considering the lineup that we have going on right now. And then we have the hoopty. So we'll probably follow all these guys in the hoopty. But until then, we're just gonna chat it up and get ready to roll on this awesome day in Austin, Texas. We turn around. the sound that means it's time to go. Let's get it. So we got to the track, everyone is all ready to roll. 
They're gonna do a lead follow first to get all warmed up, learn the track and all that. So we're gonna head over and watch them all go around the lap one time. Oh my God, dog, look at that. Oh man. Such a beast, freaking UFO. So we're gonna go watch them go around the track and see what they can do. This is something you don't see very much. The G-Wagon Landolet or Cabriolet, something like that. But it's a convertible. P1's leading the pack as it should, followed by that sick F12. So these are all the cars we got running today.
I just got a helmet, so you know what that means. We are jumping in something. Uh, I just talked to this guy with a GT3 RS, and he said I can ride with him next next time he goes out. And he is whooping up on everybody, let me tell you that. So I think this is gonna be an awesome day. Uh, we'll just keep looking around, checking out the cars on the track, and hopefully we'll get to jump in one pretty soon. This is the place to be, let me tell you. I never ever thought I'd be in a P1. Chassis number 007. That explains all the 007 stuff. But well, this is just insane crazy. Wow. This is the best place to be in the world right now. I wouldn't want to be anywhere else. I just noticed that it's like it's really compact like it's more comfortable than the LT but I just feel like I'm hugged which I probably should be if you're gonna be going like 200 miles an hour in this thing we got the racing harnesses this is just so amazing I can't believe look at the roof you see right through the roof and then look at all that space behind you right there that's crazy all right well this is probably the only time I'll ever get to sit in a P1 so let's just get out of it gracefully. Oh my head. Look like a rock star getting out of that thing. But that was awesome. First time ever in a P1. And I'm glad I got to be this one.
right, we're gonna jump in the GT3 RS real quick. bumped into the top of my list once again for like non hypercar oh Jesus Christ we did a 232 I don't know if that's good I think it is cuz I felt fast as fuck oh my god yeah that one's definitely going in the garage one day I'll take that over an R8 Huracan Aventador any day of the week oh my god I don't know if we're gonna get in anything else but if we don't that just made my day absolutely 100%. Thank you so much to the owner for taking me out. Wow. I got about an hour left here before I have to head back home. So we're gonna see. I'm gonna ask if we can get a ride in the P1. That, that'd that be sick too. But I don't know if that's gonna happen. So we'll see what happens. And we got about an hour left. So we'll check out what's going around the track now.
saying goodbye to all these awesome cars because I have to head out. So, I'd just like to thank everybody that made this experience great for me. Thanks to all the owners for bringing out their cars. And thank you to Coda for hosting this awesome event. So I'm gonna go drop off my helmet, get back in the hoopty, and head back to Houston, Texas. So, if you liked the video, please leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I will see you in the next video.